so earlier I was talking about how the trio, we all grew up together. But I did want to talk about Avi and Kevin, and that's a great part of the story. So, we'll start with Kevin and Lucia, you guys. This guy's like the most talented man on the planet. He goes on. And, um, when we were looking for beatboxers, we didn't know what to do. So we went on YouTube and we typed in beatboxers. And, um, when we, sorry, whew, lost my train of thought. So, oh yeah, the first video that came up when we used to beatboxers was a video of Kevin playing cello and beatboxing. And we were totally blown away. And so, we, when we were putting the show together, we were like, we know it's technically an acapella show, but why not bring out the cello for a song or two? because he literally was like, I am Buffy. <laughs> and I was like, just telling the group that. But now he's an amazing musician, and when we were arranging E.T., he was telling me that he could do this thing where he sings two notes at once. And I, of course, I was like, oh yeah, sure, that's real cool. <laughs> just didn't believe him at all. But, he can, so every show I insist he shows you guys over to his You guys are a very awesome crowd. Seriously. I love this vibe. It's a very, very good vibe. Thank you. Okay. So I did overtone singing on the last tour, but I wanted to do it again this time, but a little bit different. So I am going to do the Lion Sims tonight with other dogs. But when you're listening, don't listen to the note that I'm singing. Listen to the whistle tones you'll hear about it. Okay. I hope you guys like it. Oh, I love you too. 